Hi all, rounding out our UK disc for the time being is the Launch Discs Lander. Right, so um, here's the lander. Um, it weighs in at a what's it, four speed, five glide, zero turn, and two fade. And um, in the Omega plastic, it's um, it's not too bad. That's it's taken quite a lot of effort to like to bend it like that. It's um, pretty stiff. It's got like um, it's actually quite a sharp head edge. It's not as blunt as let me just. Yeah, it's not as blunt as most putters. It's you know got a bit of beef there to it. And it's got this tiny little bead that you can see there. So yeah, this is the Omega Plastic, and this is also branded as the Omega Plastic. Actually, this one, um, this one is well, as you can see, it's a lot more bendy. It's a lot more gummy. It holds the floor a lot nicer. Um, also, I've noticed on their website, or at least UK Disc Golf website, they have. Um, They've actually re um, done the numbers on this. This is a four, um, what was it four speed, four glide, minus 0.5 turn, and two fade. And I, I don't know, I still find this as stable as that when I throw it. It still wants to go to the left. So um, I used to use these as my putting putter, mainly because I had like three to start with. I had a UK disc off um, pack with um, some launch discs in there and um, yeah, and I bought, I think I bought the Glow Lander there as well. It's um, it's interesting because like, um, I don't think that these are the best discs for my putting style, certainly. I think they fade a little bit too much. But one thing I did notice is they're cracking for up shots. The, like, because it's a four speed, like it really wants to fly this disc. Like as a driving disc, it's amazing. It really is. It's a, it's a great, it's a great mid range more than anything. And um, as I say, I use them for um, I, because this one's like slightly grippier as well. So I've got like. I've got like a selection of um, of like grippiness um, for like if I wanted to skip a little bit, I like, get a bit of ground play or not. Like and so as and as up discs, uh, up shot discs, they're great. They really, I I, I could be very very particular about how much um, how much power I put on them, and they do, they react really well for that. Like you know, the slight little bit of the bead gives me a little bit more control on on it and um yeah like these um no smithson ones they are slightly gummier and um, as i said before and that like they really grip the ground well like i've i've had a lot of success with upshots with these as i said for me personally um like they're not the best putting putter but like i'm not taking them i've never taken them out of my bag because as a driving putter they are absolutely perfect and um like just for um just for that that control shot they're amazing i feel like this is the first um disc that i've um well maybe this one actually is a harder plastic i felt comfortable to actually start trying to learn forehands and um like this is definitely helping me get there i remember robbie c saying that like you know like learn with a putter you get, you get a forehand right with a putter then you're absolutely uh you're absolutely fine realistically if you're having trouble with approach shots like get a putter like and specifically this one like you know the four speed it's not afraid of going fast like it doesn't put on the brakes it it, it just goes and um, I said like I've had loads of um, success with like accuracy for throwing with them so yeah definitely get them up definitely get this one it's gummier it, it, when it hits the floor it absorbs that shock well and it just stays there Baby, 